Hi there, this is David, and welcome to Let's Play Secret of Mana. This game was released on the uh, PlayStation 4 as well as the PC. I opted for the PlayStation 4 version. Oh wow, that's really nice. Yeah, because the PlayStation 4 version actually has a physical edition that you can pick up at GameStop. So I went ahead and I pre-ordered that. Um, I'm all about the physical edition here. So this is different. I don't really know much about the game. Well, I mean, I, I played Secret of Mana in 1993, whenever I got it, you know, 30-something years ago? Something like that. I don't know, I can't do math today. 25 years ago, there we go. Um, and I played it, God, probably more than any other game I've ever played. Oh, wow. But, I mean, it, it was just such a great game. Uh, pivotal to me, pivotal to my childhood. I loved it. Oh, the little legend of mana, but it's different. I love the music. Oh my god. Kusanagi? Didn't it say like Excalibur, Massamoon, something else? The blade has many names, or the sword has many names, or something like that? I think it did. This is just beautiful. And the music? Oh man, this is bringing me back right now. This is really bringing me back. This is just fantastic. Oh, I can't wait to get started. So, yeah, let's just do it. Oh, look at the options that we have here. Um, yeah. Um, as far as, um... Oh, yeah, this is fine. Oh, wait, item limit? Wait, seriously? Oh! <laughs> yeah, that's kind of nice. Game commands. Oh, uh, okay. I'll, I'll deal with that as we, uh, go along. But anyway... Let's go ahead and get started. Uh, sure. Oh, yeah, English. Definitely. Uh, Randy's fine. Yeah, I heard that that was, like, the, the original name, um, for the hero, but it didn't really matter back then. And you would just put in whatever you wanted back then as well, because there was no voice acting or anything. But I heard that there was voice acting in this version. Long ago... The world prospered and humanity thrived thanks to a power known as mana. However, humans soon sought to use mana to create the ultimate weapon, a floating battleship called the Mana Fortress. This greedy arrogance angered the gods, who in turn unleashed vicious beasts into the world. A violent war between the mana beasts and the fortress engulfed the world in poison and fire until mana had all but disappeared. In humanity's bleakest hour, a hero wielding the mana sword appeared and destroyed the fortress. The world was left in shambles, and yet humanity persevered, and there was peace throughout the land. But as time passes, so history repeats. Time flows like a river and history repeats? That's classic! I've named many of my videos after that. Oh? Hey! Guys! Wait! Up! Whoa! Shh! Be quiet, stupid. If the Elder finds us here, we're done for. Yeah. We're not supposed to be here. Everyone in the village knows about the ghost. You really believe that old fib? The grown-ups just say there's a ghost to scare us away. But I did hear Grandma say she saw something shiny by the falls when she was little. Maybe it's treasure. Let's go find it. Uh, help! I'm gonna fall! Oh, I 
like the voice acting, even uh, though... Oh, ouch. Are you done? Um, I like the voice acting, even though that one with the little hat, I want to say his name is Timothy? He sounds like a valley girl, just saying. Oh, there's no way back up. Now what am I gonna do? Oh, we're gonna go exploring, Randy! That's what we're gonna do. Look at this. Oh, I haven't played this game in ages. Oh, it's bringing it back. It's bringing it back. I love it! And I love, like, the little 16-bit map up in the, uh, corner. Nice touch. Very good. Huh? Huh. So they don't actually say his name, so I guess you can change his name to whatever it is that you want. He just said, huh, listen. The village is this way, but I'll never get through here without a weapon. Yeah. Okay, so let's keep on going. Let's get this weapon. doing here <laughs> too bright what's with this light Fading already. Oh, I have to get back to the village. Okay, well let's do it. And now we have our little character profile on the bottom of the screen, um, with his HP and the status and all the kind of stuff with the sword. I think nice. Can we like turn around. There we go. Now, oh, what's going on now? Oh, are we just loading Whoa! the new map. What's a rabbi doing in a place like this? Okay, so what you want to do... Oh, it's kind of hard to slash here. Yeah, I don't want to slash, uh, forward like that. Yeah, there we go. Nice. Wait, he wasn't whacked? It was a critical hit? Oh, screw that. So what you want to do here, um, is basically just hit them once with a charged up sword. You don't have to hold down the X button or anything to charge up the sword. You just kind of, bam, smash them with it. Die, Rabbi, die. Yikes. Whoa. Uh-oh. Ah. Yeah, I haven't played... Seriously, Rabbi? I haven't played, um, <laughs> an action RPG in quite some time, as you could probably tell. Um, it's been ages since I played Secret of Mana. Yikes. But, um, I'll do my best. Especially, like, now that it's... I guess you would call this 3D, although it looks 2D to me. I'm still gonna shake it? Hey! Ooh, four gold. Kinda wanted some candy, but gold will do it, too. Whoa. Yeah, that's the little rabbi special move right there. Awesome. Hey, hey, got our candy. Let's see, how do I open the ring menu? Okay, so we equipped options. Oh, the same options as before. Uh, let's see. Is it equipped? Oh. Okay. Oh, I see. We have little stat uh, things down there on the corner as far as what we're immune to and everything. That's nice. Wow, our evade is 40%. That's cool. Uh, let's see, option. Action grab. Oh, wait. Oh, oh, we don't get to set up, like, the little, um, the little actual grid thing? Well, maybe we do for our, um, party members. Oh, cool. I like this. Huh. That's kind of nice. Yeah. Oh, wait, what does this say? Oh, wait, no, I don't want to go to here. Uh, let's see, yeah, I'm playing this kind of blind, as you can see. Oh. So we have character unlocks that we can do here, monster unlocks that we can do, but we don't get stats for the monsters? That's, um, kind of unfortunate. Don't have magic yet. Oh, this is everything that I was just looking at before. Uh, what's this? Oh, a map. Oh, nice. Oh, cool. We get a little log. Wow, we didn't have that in the first game. Very cool. Uh, what else is there? What's this? Oh, okay, stats. Sounds good. Very nice. 
Uh, anything else in here? I don't think so. Targeting? Oh, yeah, we'll deal with that later. Okay, so let's just, uh, whoa, be on our way. If I die by rabbi, I will just turn the game off right now. Yo! I find it's harder to hit these guys in uh, this version of the game than it ever was in the SNES version. Maybe I was just younger and better at action RPGs back then. Had more dexterity, I guess. But hey, nice. Okay, let's just move and right along. Sweet. I love how they explode into little bubbles and everything. It's so nice. Ah. Man, thank God for 40% evasion. Whew, I'm gonna need it. Ah. So yeah, um, as, uh, as I'm fighting... Whoa, get away from me. Oh, hey, hey. Uh, we can gain weapon skills, and as you gain weapon skills, your attack power will go up. Um, but the real way to level up your weapons comes later. So yeah, just deal with that right now. And it actually gets harder to level up the weapons as you go along. Oh, no, there we go. And whoa, as you can see, the little... 100% bar on the bottom of the screen? Holy crap! Man, these rabbits are kicking my ass! I hope this isn't an indication of things to come. And people wonder why I play RPGs on easy. Like, <laughs> it's stuff like this. I mean, come on. Oh, well, gained a level. Restored all my HP, so that's kind of nice. Sweet! Get some more candy. But as I've been trying to say... There is a 100% bar on the bottom of the screen. You want it to get up to 100% before you attack an enemy, because then you can deal a lot more damage than if you just swing wildly. Man, it took me this entire time just to say that. So many things were going on. Oh, we've made it to the village. Hey there. Do you see that? Something lit up the sky near the falls a moment ago. I have a bad feeling about it. Really? You know what? Now that I hear her voice and I'm shocked that NPCs actually have voices, I feel like the background music is a little bit too... too loud for the voices. I'm gonna, yeah, adjust that just a little bit. Okay. Talk to me, lady! The Elder was looking for you. What did you do this time? I'm not sure if I'm a fan of this particular remake. On an errand for the Elder? Don't dawdle. Welcome! What'll it be? Let's see. Uh, you can buy some candy, which restores your HP. Overalls I already have. A bandana would be very nice. So I'll go ahead and buy that. A cup of wishes revives you, and a medical herb cures poison. Anything else? Uh, no, I'm good. Come again! Thanks, dancing dude! Uh, let's see. Let's go ahead and put that bandana. There we are. Awesome. And just uh, be on our way. Let's see, talk to them, talk to them. Oh, nice little apple tree there. Can I destroy that? No, I can't swing my sword inside of town. It's kind of unfortunate. One night is five GP. Um, no. <laughs> I, I actually like how the shopkeepers even talk to you, and they're still dancing around like idiots. Oh my god, I freaking love it. Oh, I love this game so much. Help! Monsters have surrounded the village. We'd better stay inside until we know what's going on out there. Okay, we'll do. Hey, kid. There's an unfamiliar face in here. Uh, he looks kind of scary. I don't know. I like how you have, like, a killed rabbi on your head. It's almost like a coonskin cap. I think that guy is a knight. What's he doing in a little village like ours? These merchants are so oh, energetic. <laughs> Elliot just stopped by, but he didn't look too good. What happened? Hmm. He looks very similar to that ghost that we just saw. Yeah. Okay. Oh, hey, there's my little... Friends. Although, did I go inside this house? I think I did. Although, um, in the original version, they weren't really my friends. They were kind of my hey, bullies. Hey, stop playing with that sword before you hurt someone. I'll tell the elder on you. A little portrait of the king back there. Awesome. I love the attention to detail. Look at this. This is just, oh, this is so nice. 
Oh, you're all right. Elliot just told me what happened. I thought you were a goner. That's why I told you not to bring someone like him along. You idiots. None of you were supposed to wander into that area. What's that you have there? Oh, no. It couldn't be. Cool. Did you find the treasure? Way to go. What have you done? That's the mana sword. There's no way you could have pulled it free. Mana sword? But legend says the village will be destroyed if it's removed. I never thought it'd come to this. The mana sword is said to protect the village from disaster. But now... Aha! So you're the reason all those monsters are attacking us! You yanked out the sword and doomed the whole village! It's your fault, you outsider! Boom! Hey, stop! Shut up! It's all your fault! Leave me alone! Ugh, an earthquake! Yikes! Ah! Oh no! Help! I'm a monster! You have a sword? Why don't you use it? Can you hear me? Calm down and study the enemy's movements to look for an opening! I'll do my best, old dude. Yikes. Okay, let's see. Looks like he's guarding from the front, so... Yeah, let's try to attack from behind! Oh, sweet! Yeah, with spells like that, there's nothing that you can do about it. Is it Acid Breath or Acid Rain? In the original version, it was Acid Rain, and it lowered your defense, but it doesn't look like it's lowering my defense. Yikes! Yeah, don't let him land on you. Uh, hey! Whoa! Whoa! That did a lot more damage than it did the first time. What's up with that? Whenever he jumps up, just keep on running around so he doesn't land on top of you. Whoa! Yeah, that's an Earth Elemental uh, attack that can deal that. some pretty rough damage, as you can tell. Hey, nice! And we got him! Sweet! Not bad, not bad at all. Hey, get a sword's orb. You did well. Wait there, I'll pull you up. Stay back. I didn't do nothing. Whatever you bitch. You seem to be in possession of the real mana sword. This is troubling. Why is that? Legend says the sword can only be retrieved by a knight when the world is in peril. But you are far too young for such a responsibility. Something must be wrong with the mana sword. Here, you take it. No, I cannot. The sword has lost its power. It must be restored. Only the one who pulled it free can do that. Then what should I do? Visit Sage Luca in the Water Palace. The Sage has protected these lands for over 200 years. You would do well to listen to her advice. Hey! The Elder wants you to come to his house. I'll be off. I have duties to attend. My name is Gemma, and I'll be waiting for you at the Water Palace. Gemma, like the Gemma Knights from Final Fantasy Adventure? Well, what does the Elder want, and can we make it to this water palace? Find out next time, and let's play Secret of Mana. This has been David. If you like this, please like, comment, and subscribe, and have a good day.